one thing that's really important is whenever we're interpreting the Bible is to always try to understand it in its original context. The, the, the context of the Old Testament is called the ancient Near East. It includes Egypt and Canaan, Palestine, that whole, that whole area, uh, Mesopotamia, and uh, it's called the ancient Near East. And what we know is that uh, we've now discovered a number of creation stories in the cultures of the ancient Near East. In fact, a number of these creation stories, most scholars date prior to the biblical story. In fact, the, the biblical story parallels these other stories, at least some of these other stories, in certain respects. For example, in the Babylonian account, um, the, we have the six days of creation, just like we have in, in the biblical account. And it, it's the same order and the same weirdness, too, because you have uh, light being created before there's the sun and the moon. And so there's a lot of stylistic similarities there. Uh, what we know about these, these cultures, however, is this. Those creation stories weren't told, in some cases sung, they, were, they weren't told or sung for the purposes of explaining, in any kind of sort of scientific way, how the world came to be. That wasn't the question they lived in. The question they lived in was this. Who do we look to as the highest God, and who do we trust to protect us? In these other ancient Near Eastern accounts, there's, there's always a battle that goes on before the creation of the world and the creation of human beings. And the winner of that battle was Marduk defeated Tiamat in, 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 in one case. Uh, he, he then carves out of the body of the defeated Tiamat, this evil deity, creates human beings and creates the world. So we're formed by the victorious good God, but we're made out of the material of the defeated bad God. And that was their way, it was kind of their account of the fall. They're trying to explain, why are human beings such a contradiction? We're never as good as we know we should be. You see, we're all, it's because we're formed with a good God, but out of this bad material. That was, that, that was their explaining it. But their point was not to give a, a scientific account of, the, of creation, but rather to say, who can we look to to protect us from evil and from destruction and to fight with us in our battles? And, and so they would look to the victorious God uh, and, and, and exalt him because he was the one who formed this world uh, by defeating the other forces of evil. The question wasn't how, the question was who. So also in the biblical account, if you understand it in the ancient Near East, the question isn't how, the question is who. 